this is a lecture on Green's theorem. Now it's pretty straightforward and we've just got a simple definition which is here, followed by an example which I'll do. So uh, just to start off, Green's theorem, this is where you have an integral over a space of p dx plus q dy. Now this can be changed into the double integral of, of the space s of dq over dx minus dp over dy dx dy. And that, that's pretty much it. The only other thing I can say is that if we have a negative space, then in order for this to equal that, we just put a negative in front, in front of that. It has to be minus integral s, minus s, sorry, p dx plus q dy. Now our example that we're going to do now is going to be uh, this. So if, if we have i, that can be our integral that we're going to do. c y squared minus sine e to the x plus xy. And this can be our dx part. And then we have to have our dy part, which is going to be our q of x squared plus shine 4y minus 2xy. And that can be our dy part. Now, as we've set up here, we have our p, which is this part here, our dx, our q, and our dy. So what we have to do is work out q dx. So, uh, so if we differentiate this with respect to x, we get uh, 2x. No x is in here, so that's it looks messy, but it's not really at all. Minus 2y, because y is a constant. Yeah, these are, these are partial derivatives. And again, we have to do the same for uh, d rp, which you differentiate that with respect to y. So dp over dy equals, uh, where we're here, which is 2y, there's no y's in here, plus x. Yeah? So now we just have to do the double integral s of this, subtract that, which is 2x minus 2y minus 2y minus x which equals the double integral of uh, x minus 4y. And from this, it's a simple double integral over whatever your space may be.